Hi everybody, it's Sheila. Welcome back to the Crochet Nurse channel. Today what we're going to do is open up our monthly Mary Maxim Crochet Kit of the Month. And I think this is for the month of November. I've gotten a little confused with the changes that they've done at Mary Maxim. By that I mean they changed the shipping, and the ship, not only the shipping price, but when they're actually shipping things out. It seems now that we're being billed roughly in the middle of the month and then they're shipping it out in the end of the month so that way we get it right in the first couple of days of the month and that's been happening consistently for the last two months now which has been really good okay so i believe this is going to be for the month of november and as we've done in the past we'll go back and review what happened for the month of october and you see baron's with us today he's he, he i think he's cold he's been trying to sit on my lap all day long because it's cooled off down here we're in like the mid 50s to 60s and I think he's cold so he wants to stay warm so let's do a recap of last month we'll talk about that and I'll show you what we had oh and I have my computer ready so that way um, if I have time and if it doesn't take up too much of your time I'll look up whatever the yarn is and see if we can find prices like we normally do okay so let's backtrack to last month last month we got four balls of this maypole dk and i got the color of rose something rose it's 100 percent polyester yarn and there was like oh hot rose and like 200 and almost 70 yards per skein and we got four skeins of this and this is what i have left over from the four skeins um, from what i made and the item that we were making was this scarf and I had shared with y'all last month that I probably would not make that scarf because I just don't wear scarves down here and I didn't make that so but I did make something else and I want to show you what I did so that was what it was supposed to be four skeins to make that one scarf but what I did is I took the maypole and added some other yarn off of my yarn wall over there and I made a cover, kind of, for the back of my sofa. I'm going to put a picture up in a second, but I'm going to show you the design. So, and it looks something like this. This is one of the designs. I'll hold it up so you can see. And it is pretty large. And you can see all of those really pretty colors for this guy. And it measures, um, this one, this piece here measures about 24 by 45. And where I picked up the pattern for this, there's the center part of this. We're getting crooked here. Oop. There we go. The center part of this is the maypole. So this part in the middle, middle is the maypole. And then the outer edge right here, I used uh, Color Deal from Yarn B. I got this on clearance, and this was only a size one, so I double stranded it. And the outer edge up here, I used a skein of Marble Esque from Yarn B as, as well. And so I threw a lot of yarn at this to get this done. The pattern itself, I found the pattern from Crochet, you know, Captain Crochet. He's on YouTube. And this is called Wisp Piece Pattern. And there's actually a couple folks that actually teach how to do it. And it is three videos um, long to complete this piece. And it just shows how to do one square and then I just made a bunch of them and put them together. In total, I have 18 squares. And so, now that I'm done showing you this way, I'll pop the picture up and so you can see what it looks like laid out. Um, but it looks nice on the back of my couch. It gives me a pop of that, of that magenta in the living room, which is really pretty. But it allowed me to use up some of my yarn. Okay, so that's that. That's what I did last month. I'm happy with the piece. So let's move on to this one. 
I'm really excited to get this month. Um, I haven't went out and looked at any videos to see what's in here. Um, I'm feeling one, two, feels like four. I'm wondering if it's acrylic again, because there's quite a bit of yarn in here. So let's get in here, get my scissors. He's going to stay, isn't he? You're okay, Baron. He's never last time. Guys, when I start opening up the wrestling of the packages, he starts to get nervous. So we'll see if he stays. Oh my goodness. That's a fat little package. Now, for those who are not familiar, again, I'll share. Ooh, pretty. Um, first month is $9.99. And then every month thereafter is $14.99. And the shipping is $4.99, which is reduced because oh, my hair is kind of funky now it's reduced it used to be like eight bucks and they reduced the price and so now it's a little bit better for that and what month are they saying this is uh doesn't say but still priced 1998 is what we're all in for and here we go Ooh, orange guys and you guys know how i like orange Look at that orange. Look at that. You guys know I like orange, so this is going to be something right up my alley. Let's see what we got. Let's look at the yarn. I got four skeins of this. Let me fix that for you. It's called Babe Soft Cotton Worsted, and it is soft. Oh, I like that. I got some other orange I can pair that with over there. Let me look at it. 53% acrylic, 45% cotton, 246 yards, 3.5 ounce. And it says for crochet hook, I9. That is pretty soft stuff. Let's look at the size. Let me let you guys look at that. There is the size for you. Bam. It's got oranges. Man, this is right up my alley. It's like it's like Mary Maxim really sends me stuff they think I'll like, I guess. I don't know. But there's four of them. So well over a thousand yards for babes. I don't even know who makes this. This color, by the way, it's made in China. Euro Yarns again from Knitting Fever. This is called Candy Corn. Perfect for the month of October, right? Okay, got that in there. Four of those. And then this cute little croquette. Look at that. Look at those colors. Sorry, buddy. 239 yards, 1.5 ounce. I've been wanting to try this. And size one. That's okay, because I was using this guy last month as a size one. I don't know how far I'll do it that way. And this is 92% cotton is what it is. So croquette, let me see what that is. And then we're going to look at the pattern and see what that is. I think Baron's kind of sticking around. Knitting fever, babe worsted. Sorry about that, buddy. I am seeing out of the gate for that $9.95 per is what I'm seeing and I don't know if this yeah yeah if this colorway is discounted or discontinued but so for at 10 four of them 40 bucks if that's the retail and then croquette so we're already at 40 bucks I'm pretty happy with that I'm not really a big fan of red heart um, but I will use it especially if the pattern's pretty uh, red heart croquette I see it for five dollars, so we're at forty-five dollars for uh, for the price. So we're in a good spot. And remember, we paid twenty, so I'm happy with that. Let's look at the pattern. There's some. This is weird. I got a whole bunch of stuff. Okay. Um, I have a beanie. So clearly I didn't get the blue, I got the orange. So that's one pattern in there. It says fits most women. 
Oh, no, not again. <laughs> and then little stocking things for the feet. And this clearly is for the orange, right? Okay. I might make those just because my feet are always cold. Oh, look at this. And then this is a scarf for the croquette. And it is from Moogly. So this is out there in the wild, guys. And so if you, this pattern, if you have, want, you know, get the croquette, this one's out there in the wild. And I do like Moogly patterns. So you know what? I like that. I, I will probably make that too, even though I really don't like scarves. But I can use that on my jacket. Fantastic. I'm happy with what I've gotten. Love the orange. Love the blue. I say, I'll probably make the little stocking, the little feet things. I'll look at that. Don't know about the cap yet. I'll have to think about that. And I'll probably even make the scarf. I, li I like that too. Let me look at the length and determine that. Okay. But that's what I wanted to share with you guys today. And I am off to go make some stuff. Up and bye. Baron says bye guys. You guys have a fantastic day and I will chat with you next time. Bye.